Time now for your weekend download. Just hours from now, we will find out who is in the college football playoffs. ESPN's David Pollock joins us from Bristol, Connecticut, ESPN's worldwide leader headquarters. Good morning, David. Let's get right to, to this. I mean, just when you thought Alabama was going to be mortal yesterday and perhaps lose to Georgia, a powerhouse team, they, they come back and win again. I mean, can anybody beat this team? Uh, yes. Um, I mean, I think Georgia... Georgia beat them everywhere yesterday, but the scoreboard, that doesn't count, and there's no consolation prize for that. But I, th- I think when you start to look towards the playoffs, Clemson's a team that's been really, really dominant all year long. They have zero losses. They're a team that has a great defensive line. They could possibly control a line of scrimmage, and they've, they've scored a lot of points. And, and listen, Georgia's another team. I think if you watched that game yesterday, you're sitting there walking away going, if Georgia played them again, I think Georgia could beat them. So I think there's a couple teams, but it's, it's, it is very clear, and it's been Bama fatigue for a while probably at our network but um, Clem, uh, Alabama is definitely the best team in the country. So uh, given, what you, given what you just said, I mean, I guess Georgia doesn't really have an argument to be in. We're looking at now Ohio State to be the fourth or, or Oklahoma. Which do you think is, is going to get in? Well, the, the committee chair and the, and the committee charge is always to get the four best teams. So I think Georgia still is very much in play. Now, listen, they, they had a shot, and I think you could argue – that they lost, and, and that might be enough to keep them out. And then you decide between Oklahoma and Ohio State. And Oklahoma's only loss is to Texas this football season. And guess what? They avenged that loss in the Big 12 championship game yesterday. They can score points in bunches. They're exciting. Their defense is not great. If you don't watch a lot of college football, they're not great at all. But their offense is fun. They are fast. they got a quarterback in Kyler Murray that dances around, can run around, can throw it all over the yard. They're almost indefensible when it comes to the offensive side of the football. So if it's between Oklahoma and Ohio State, I think Oklahoma will get the nod because avenging their only loss, not having a bad loss on their uh, on their resume like uh, like Ohio State does. I just love the new system. I mean, I always say I want to do if, to go to eight teams, but then we wouldn't be having this yeah. conversation every year. Yeah. So four teams it is. Uh, David Pollock, uh, along with the ESPN crew. Thank you, my man. We'll see you today at noon Eastern time. It goes right on through four o'clock. The uh, college football playoff selection show on ESPN. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.